36-year-old Howard Desjardins is helping his brother landscape this backyard in East Regina. But he's not your typical landscaper. He had both his legs amputated after two separate injuries led to severe infections. He had his first amputation at 19 years old and the second at 28. Since then, Desjardins has been keeping busy by taking care of yards around Regina. It is keep me motivated. My legs is keep me going. They don't stop me. Although his amputations don't appear to be slowing him down physically, he says the ordeal has taken a toll on him emotionally. I cry here and there at night time for like I miss them. I do miss them. But I'm here and then I don't let them stop me from doing what I want to do. Although he is motivated now, this was not the case after his second surgery. I think he did kind of go into a depression uh, when he couldn't get work and whatnot. And he kind of fell off and done drugs and alcohol. Once he got over that, he was really, really back, back to himself and getting on with work. And she says her son has been a hard worker since he was a kid. He mowed lawns, shoveled driveways, and did odd jobs to earn money for the family. Even after losing half of his legs, he still does whatever he can to help. The money he earns goes towards his two kids. But it's not just about the money. Just to show people I'm not lazy. Nah, everybody should, everybody has their thing. They know what they have to do. I got my thing, so, you know, don't be lazy. <laughs> just go and work. Don't let yourself down, just do what you have to do. Don't, don't let these bring you down. Don't let your injuries, your health bring you down. Just be healthy. Do what you have to do. Desjardins is currently working with one of his brothers trying to get as many job opportunities as possible. He recently had a scooter donated to him and he's hoping to get a trailer as well to keep his equipment in. Corey Coleman, CBC News, Regina.